Hey guys, Bing here. Um, today I'm going to show you how to model a helmet in Revit. Okay, so it will be something like this. Okay, so let's start. So first, uh, create a new family. So I'll just model it as a generic model. Okay, so so first I'm going to uh, place some reference planes. I'm not going to make it parametric, but uh, I'll, I'll just use this reference plane to um, to roughly get the dimension. So roughly, yeah, I think that's pretty much okay. And uh, this will be this width. And I'll check the width. Yeah, roughly one meter. That's fine. So go also go to front view. So this will be the height. So do a dimension overall. Um, I'm not sure. Maybe 800, maybe. And then it will go down here, there. So first, uh, I'm going to model it uh, using sweep. And also, I'll I'll create I'll, I'll use um, reference line as a path. Okay. So first. I'm going to go to floor plan. I'll just need to set the work plan and pick a plan and pick this uh, reference reference plan. So now pick the front view. So in the front view, I'm going to create uh, place some reference line. So from here to I think roughly here, and then. Select this reference plane, MM, mirror, and then go back to create reference line again. So this time use the fillet arc and pick this reference line and this reference line and then try to um, create a, an arc. Okay, so now we have one, two, three, three uh, reference plan. So we're going to create a sweep using these three reference plan sorry reference lines okay so now create sweep pick path and uh, pick the middle one first so we, uh, we, we will be able to place the profile uh, perpendicular to this reference the middle one okay so now finish so edit profile so you can go to left or right and we can draw the shape of that um, so imagine you cut this in the middle so the shape of that arc so same i'm going to just draw a um, straight line probably here and then i'll mirror this and then go fill it up one two and roughly three so now we need we need OF offset OF and I'll just use 10 okay so and I just uh, and just move your cursor onto one of the uh, line and the tab so we can create three uh, offsets all together and then just close this these two ends and then create this close sketch so finish it and okay so now if i go to 3d view you will see so now we have this um sweep and then what we need to do is we go to floor plan we just need to cut cut the edge okay so go create void extrusion and uh, i'll just do it uh, from probably this here and then I guess roughly here and then select select it mm mirror and then flip arc roughly here and then select three of them mirror so now and place a rec a shape any shape outside so we can create a void so I'll just show you finish and then go to 3D view. So, so this is the void. Okay. So when it's not cutting anything, it show 
shows orange. And then if I drag this up, and no, it's not cutting, but that's fine. Just go here, cut geometry, click on the solid first, and click on the void. So now we have this shape. Yeah, I think it's it's okay. It's it's good enough for for uh, just a um, a family. So um, so it's not exactly the shape of that, but uh, I think should be should be okay. And then let's just model the the frame. Okay, so um, okay, so I'm going to use sweep for this uh, frame as well. So for the first one. First one will be placed on this reference plan. Okay, so create set set word plan, pick plan, okay, and pick this one. And then go to the front view and I'll draw I'll draw a, oh sorry, I'll place a sweep and then I'll use sketch path instead of pick path. Because this time we don't have anything to pick, so I'll just create a sketch path, and then um, actually I'm going to um, maybe I'm going to start from here. Okay, so from here, and then select it, mirror, mirror to the other side. So and then create an arc. Roughly, um, roughly down to here, and now then, okay, and then edit profile. So I'm just going to do it in maybe 3D view. So now we just need to draw a shape here. So for example, I'll draw a a radius, uh, a circle here, and then finish it. And okay, so now we have this. Right, so yeah, uh, maybe not that <laughs> sharp angle. That's too dangerous. Um, yeah, what you can do is edit sweep and then edit path. So instead of have that, you can just so yeah. Sometimes you can just trim them. You go to uh go to front view so we can mirror this mm. Pick the mid center reference reference plan and then trim them so. Yep, good. So now we're going to model this leg. So um, for this leg, I'm going to use sweep as well. But before that, I'll need to we'll need to create two reference plan. I'll roughly place it here. Okay. So now just mirror it to the other side, and uh, um, helm. Uh, no, we don't need that actually. Sorry, we can just place this place the profile in this reference plan and only use one. I'll just show you. Okay, so I'll set work plan, pick plan, and pick this work plan, and then go to the left or right. So now we're going to create a uh, play, place a sweep and then sketch a path. So this will be a path of the leg. So it's an arc. Okay. So I'll just uh, maybe I'll just make it more stable, just to a little bit long, longer here. Oh, sorry, I forgot to. So use the arc. So what's this arc? Start and radius arc. So start end and roughly maybe here okay so finish edit profile so this time go to front view and here what i'm going to do is go draw a circle profile i'm not going to draw it in the center instead i'll just draw at the same height roughly here still the same Part of the profile, I'll just draw a circle here and 20 mil. Okay, and then select this profile, mm, and go the other way, the, the other side. 
and finish it and finish it so now if I go to 3D view so that's so it's one sweep and then let me try to join them so as you can say sometimes uh, it won't work but uh, if it, that's because when you have you know these arc and all the, the tangent all these like very tiny face surface it won't work what you can do is just um, just move it a little bit so and let's try again join so now this time it works okay so and yeah so that's it so if you want to for example this if you can just uh, just do a void to cut cut the legs so it won't yeah so finish it just drag oh is it a void yeah so cut solid void so yeah okay so that's it um and also for this shape if you want to change because we use pick path for the sweep for this one so if we so for example this is a reference line this is part of the shape so you can, if you drag this one you can see it also change the shape of that see and if you want to change the profile of that you will need to edit the sweep and select profile edit profile and then you need you will need to um, so manually um, adjust this profile so I'll quickly do it so for example I'll just go to left left and I'll delete everything everything except this one so I'll just probably just make it like deeper and then mirror up there radius and uh, OF tab and then close it okay so finish finish so now you can see you actually change the shape of this so okay so um, yeah you probably need to adjust this frame as well so anyway so that's that's it that's it for today um, if, if you have any questions or if you have better idea please let me know i'll see you next time thank you bye